Arsenal fan TV, what do you make of it today? Yeah, it was good. Like obviously pre-season, I, I, I'm glad we won it this year because we, we haven't won it since uh, yeah, yeah, 2007. Yeah. It's getting a bit embarrassing, do you know what I mean? It's our own cup. So um, yeah, like looking into the new season, I'm confident. But looking at the squad, it's not you, as a lot. Everyone's saying you need a world-class striker. We haven't got one, therefore we're not going to win a league. So who is the world-class striker uh, we need? For, in, in my opinion, Benzema. Mm. But how people, how people are not. How people are not saying Benzema's not world class, I just think you're fucking deluded because you clearly haven't watched what that geezer has done mm. in La Liga for the past three, four years. Mm. You, but at the end of the day, but you, if you're we not are unable, if we're unable to yeah, listen, yeah. listen, listen, that is a possible deal yeah. depending on many different things, right? Now, if that doesn't happen and we're unable to get him, right? What are you saying? You're saying that you don't believe? Couldn't the goals not be shared? I mean, yeah, we've got a world-class player in Alexis Sanchez. You've got emerging. I mean, you've got emerging players like Alex Oxlade Chamberlain, etc. Oh, brilliant talent. Can the goals not be shared yeah. up front? And it's, you know, I, I had a guy saying to me yesterday, it's not, it's not about scoring goals for Arsenal this season. It's about defending. Yeah, yeah, it's true because. Uh, well, that's another position. You're not going to win the league with Per Mertens like a plan at centre back because it's, it's not going to happen. Mm. And um, but. I, I, I think realistically, I can't see us signing any other striker because I just think Wenger is content with Giroud up there. Therefore, you, 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 have to, you have to look at the options with the squad we have at the moment. The squad at the moment, I think, looks incredibly strong. Obviously, apart from that's because I, I don't, I'm not a massive fan of Giroud. But mm. I think with the light you saw yesterday, the likes of Ozil, Ramsey, Oxlade Chamberlain, Oxlade Chamberlain, this season is going to be his year, I'm telling you. Mm. He is an amazing player. And obviously, you've got, you've got the likes of Sanchez, Ozil, Ramsey, they're all, they're all coming through, all pushing mm. this squad further now. And, mm. uh, but but <laughs> without that world class striker, you're not going to win a league and we will not get a world class striker. I'll put money on it, we won't get one. So, forget Benzema, let's just say you, you, we you, got know, Benzema, you get I'm, wrong. I'm, I'm, I'm very confident we'd, we would, I'm not saying we would 100% win the league. But I'm very, very confident we would go very close mm. or if, if, we, if we didn't win it. You know, like, mm. he's a striker who, uh, who is world, world class. So, so for you, Benzema, and it's, we're there, ne nearly there. Nearly there, wait. <laughs> it's, my little, it's my little cousin, who do you want, who do you want us to sign? Bentner. Bentner? <laughs> <laughs> Lewandowski. Yeah, Lewandowski, <laughs> class, class. <laughs> We, we are a team. We can entertain when we're playing the uh, the bottom half of the team, but, but when we when we play the top sides, mm -hmm. we mustn't be trying to be too clever and try and outplay. That's what I'm trying to say. I, yeah, it's I, being a bit more clever. Yeah, but that's why I don't think it's about being clever. This is the way he sets the team up, and this is the way we know how to play, isn't it? 